sales and marketing team at Time7. We are putting together a video series of our antenna portfolio. Today, I'm going to talk to you about our A5020 far field and A5020 near field and their differences. From the outside, they are identical. Both antennas have a rugged IP68 rated housing, which is fully waterproof, dustproof and corrosion resistant. It can easily be washed down with high water pressure for hygiene conscious applications. This makes both antennas suitable for indoor and outdoor uses, including in damp and wet conditions, as well as very cold temperatures down to minus 40 degrees Celsius. However, both antennas perform very differently. Let me demonstrate to you. We have here our A5020 True Near Field Antenna, which has no far field components. And here, our A5020 Far Field Antenna, which has a radiating near field and far field read zone. Both are connected to an Impinge R220 Speedway Reader, operating at full power and max sensitivity. I will now demonstrate the performance of both antennas with three different tag types. Starting with a SmartTrack Trap NF tag, a pure near field tag. As you can see, it reads right on the antenna's surface and stops approximately one centimetre above the surface. Moving on to the far field antenna, it can also read from the surface, but the read range is much farther. Next, we have the SmartTrack Bling tag. This is a hybrid tag, which is more sensitive to near field. The read distance from the near field's antenna surface is slightly more, approximately two centimeters. Whereas on the far field antenna, the tag can be read a lot further. Lastly, we have here a smart track dog bone tag, which is a far field sensitive hybrid tag. Holding this over the A5020 near field antenna, you can see that it stops reading at around 30 centimeters. Holding the dog bone over the far field antenna, it is reading it no matter where I move it. Time7 is a recognized solutions leader. If you've got a project you need advice on, please get in touch. We can talk you through our extensive antenna portfolio and try to find the most suitable model for your application with the best outcome for any project.